As people, we're just curious about how things work. We want to get closer and more involved to see the inner workings. Welcome to A Look Inside. Join us as we take a closer look at people, places, and things, and what makes them work. going to take a look at some of the things you uh, may not know that we have on the fire truck and or on this here is our rescue truck we carry uh, extrication equipment mainly on this truck we have k-12s regular chainsaws we have the ropes for high angle rescue we have um, uh, emergency medical equipment oxygen med bag fully stocked we have uh, hard wire communication systems for like underwater or in confined space areas. We have an onboard air system. Some of our rescue equipment, vehicle rescue ext extrication equipment, we have airbags, all the hoses and et cetera to go with the airbags. This is our onboard cascade system for filling air bottles on the scene we don't have to come back we can fill up about 40 air bottles on the scene if needed on a fire or any type of scene this is where we keep some of the heavier equipment we have full construction equipment in here saws nails those type of things for construction these boards here are for our uh, trench rescue in case we have a trench collapse we can do some smaller trench rescues with this quick response trench rescue which we've also just taken a course in the trench rescue. This here is what everybody knows of as the jaws of life, etc. Power pack, you got spreaders, O-ring cutters, chains, etc. if we need them. Same here, we got a little bit more, we got the rams, hand tools, hacksaws, those type of uh, extrication equipment. Uh, hammer, sledgehammers, for extrication or whatever, collapse. Over here we got a portable air system. It's called our air cart. We can use for the airbags or anything away from the truck. Uh, ventilation fan for con confined areas. Here we have more of our high angle rescue with our ropes, life safety ropes, and our bags that carry all our carabiners and etc. Standard fire extinguishers. my 22 years of service i haven't seen it change a ton but it, what we've changed here at the covenant fire department is we've started running the medical field of it the, the medical end um, all our trucks right now are advanced life support and uh, we, we can do just about everything except for transport and that's that's probably one of the major changes here at the fire service <laughs> 